Oh. Hi. Have you been sitting there the whole time? Well, join us. We're going to be with Carl on his journey through Kona, a mystery adventure. So let's tag along. He had been working as a private investigator in Montreal. William Hamilton, a rich industrialist, had gotten in touch with him regarding a simple vandalism issue. Nothing to write home about. Not worth hiring a private eye either, mm. just so he can drive for hours on rough roads. But that's how it had always been. The client pays, Carl gets it done. Oh, what? I can turn my head like 180 degrees. Jesus, Carl. That's some serious stretching you got going on. Now wasn't a good time to wonder about. Hamilton was still out there. Oh. They had set up to meet at the general store. His client's business. Well, actually, the entire village had William wow. Hamilton's name written all over it. Yeah. It's glad to see Carl practices good driving technique. That's a solid 210. That's a solid position of 2 and 10. I'd give it a... Could have a four out of five. He could he could be gripping a little harder, but it's when okay. When the roads were bad, muddy, or snowed in, it was customary around these parts to close them off. But it was also customary to ignore those signs entirely and drive there anyway. Mm, I can interact. Oh, I got an empty bottle. Um, let's go here first. Can I use the phone? Nope. Oh, can I can't. Can I take the map? No, but I can look at this. Let's read it. I can't read that. Northern Quebec and its inexhaustible resources. The province of Quebec sits on an inexhaustible abundance of natural resources. Why not take advantage of this? Our <laughs> yeah, yes. Come, take our land. Our valuable minerals could travel the world and reach places as far as Dallas. Really? That's the scope? Get involved and invest now. Quebec's economic might will be awakened. Ah, uh, yeah. Quebec. It's the new... It's, it's good. It's, it's good. At the heart of the wilderness... The north is swarming with wolves, caribous, bears, partridges, foxes, snowy owls, and hordes of other majestic creatures. Hordes? Really? Are they like ransacking towns? That are every bit the equals of Africa's wildlife. Okay, come on. Come on! We are the Africa of America. Come discover the north and experience a genuine white jungle. <laughs> well, there's there more? Oh, no, okay. Yeah, let's let's experience the hordes of partridges and owls. All right, let's look up here. Is there anything else I can take here? No. All right, let's get going. Is that a car? Nope, those are rocks. Nice job, Lammy. All right, let's get moving. Ah. What is these? These little wipes? Little wet wipes? Nope, they're fire starters. Just can't clean my butt with fire starters. Not as useful as a good wet wipe. Not as useful. Oh, what's this? Can I take this? Is that a rock? Why is you guys just keep rocks on your Hamilton never watches? mentioned a road blocking barrier. Why was it needed here in the back of beyond? Yeah. That would, however, be a mystery for another day. Carl had waited long enough for someone to come and raise it. Yeah. Let's Still go. Still not a soul in sight. There was no point in waiting any longer. Carl had to figure this one out by himself. Hamilton is waiting for Carl in the general store. It was time for him to get down to business. William Hamilton enjoyed a lavish country house built in the very heart of the northern forests, not too far from here. The local populace mm. was divided when it came to the affluent man. Some saw a wealthy philanthropist dedicated to improving the region's economy. Others, an aging Englishman who would do anything to further his fortune. Yes. And those men He's just needed him enough to go on about scheming. He was him. just harnessing the economic Hamilton might of Quebec. 
but the last straw was the reopening of a mine, which gave rise to a wave of protests and threats from the free people. Given these circumstances, Carlo reckoned that a good number of people must be feeling compelled to oppose Hamilton in mm. one way or another. Ooh. So far, only the industrialists have been the target. Oh, that's only not oh. the target. Now that guy was not practicing good driving technique. Remember kids, when you're driving, look both ways and stay on your side. Also use two feet. I'm the man himself. Oh god, Carl. Carl. To get out of there. The cold and the pain required urgent care. You're, you're, you're... Your hand, Carl. Get up, Carl. Carl. Kona. Here we go. The adventure begins. The mystery is unfolding before our eyes. Do I got anything in here? I. I can. Oh. Okay. Wait, do I have a fire starter in here? I did. Cool. Alright. Let's see if this person's alive. I got crushed by a bridge. The driver had kids. Off. It Ooh. was still best to check it out and leave nothing to chance. I'll check that I'll out. Need it help. Oh, here. Open. First aid kit served to heal Carl's wounds. Cool. What's in here? Ah, open up. It was a small block. Box engraved with the letters W H. William Hamilton. Nothing was to be left to chance. It could be William. What's this? Isabel photo. Anything on the back? Such heart-wrenching Nordic poetry that was. Oh but boy. Carl didn't care much about flowery language. Isabel, you gave meaning to everything when you disappeared. So did purity. It was all gone. All of it. I would defend purity against the winds, the tides, against ice and blizzards. It was so cold. Already Carl did not feel his toes anymore. Carl, it's been like two minutes. Oh, buddy. I'll protect you against purity this until I crash. Country, his last hope was to find an abandoned garage or a farm by the roadside. His life depended on it. Carl. Buddy, don't slow down now. You're so close. Let's go in here. Come on. What's in here? Can I take this? No? Okay. Uh oh. Oh. What are these? What's it's that? Better than oh. he had hoped. Carl Faubert had succeeded once more. Oh yeah. He was now on his way to new adventures. What is this? Six matches, fire starter. Can I start a fire? No? Okay. Can I use that, uh, consumables? First aid kit. Ah, better. Do we got, like, firewood? Oh. Will this work? It will. Let's slap that in there. In that nice little oven. Close the door, Carl. God, you're letting the heat out. Jesus, Carl. Close it. Can I take this? What is this? Oh, I can start a fire with it. I don't know why that... Ah, beautiful. Let's rock. And I think people, if I'm not wrong, people put like chains on their wheels when it's really snowy and icy, so I think that's what we're supposed to do. So let's get warm and let's go do that. Okay, I think we're warm. Let's, let's go, Carl. Here we go. Can you run a little faster, buddy? Not looking to die out here. Here we go. Can we do that? Ah, we can. Ride in style. Alright, I think we. Yep. We nailed that. Um, can we get out of here? Yes, we can. It'll do it for us. Wonderful. Hey, don't don't hit the don't hit the car. All right, let's move. We gotta get, we gotta get to town. We don't want to die out here. 
What beautiful landscape Quebec has. Where are the hordes of animals, though? Huh? I haven't, I haven't been attacked by a partridge yet. Maybe they just know Carl's incredibly badass and they don't want to tussle with him. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. What's this? Manastan? Manastan? Of untouched forests, bellowing caribou, everlasting snow, and undefiled lakes. The Manistan region was no tourist hub. Boom. It was said to have been populated for millennia by Cree people, and ever since the industrial era, by the metal mining industry. Okay. So we got natives, and we got miners, and we got vast wilderness. The truck was running on fumes. Good thing that the general store was close by. How did, how does Carl know that? Oh, we have a loading screen. That's, it's a good way to keep the uh, vibe going break it up into little bits ah is this the general store Carl pull in gas up just ask the, the attendant just be like hey buddy I'm gonna need new tires too while you're at it did you turn the car off Carl no I thought you're running on fumes Okay. Pumps wouldn't surrender their divine nectar so easily. It's gas, okay. Good, they had to be switched on from inside the store. The What's milkman this? had to drive by every week to fill the bottle. The fresh milk indicated a recent visit. Mm. Fresh milk from the milkman. Can I go pee? I really gotta go pee. Um. Is that a no? You're not gonna let me use the potty? That's just rude. All right. Can I get a log? I can. I feel like I'm going to use logs. Ever so what is this? Carl was used to strange phenomena. Oh. But a chunk of ice like this? As if an iceberg came out of oh, the ground? Oh, shit. That what are those? First. Well, we're just going to snap a zoomy zoom of that. Beautiful. Prince? Carl found a surprise at every turn. Was uh, the camera faulty, or was there a possible lead? Oh, wait, are those my footprints? I feel like they are, yeah. Well, what are these guys into? What are they trying to get? What is that? Draft letter. Let it be known you're nothing more than a brigand. Was in the air. Seems like some villagers barely tolerated each other. Now that's some serious hate right there. My lord, if somebody gave me a letter with that drawn on it, I'd move. I'd get out of town real quick. That's that's serious stuff. Let it be known, you're nothing more than a brigand, a robber, a garbage hoarder, a viper, a leech, a monster. You're holding a knife at my throat. Too bad for me, but... But what? Is that it? Guess that's it. The Polaroid. Carl's long-standing and faithful ally has seen a share of husbands caught red-handed cheating. Is that There's what's going on? something out there waiting to be snapped away. Okay, I can't unlock that. Um, let's go around the front. Ooh, let's try this. Uh, nope, locked again. Yeah, let's try the front. Can I take a picture of my truck? Cute. Oh, it's very good looking. Something fell to the bottom of the box. Carl had no trouble recognizing his Yes. Mind. There was no need to be a detective to figure that out. Mm. But only a detective could have noticed that the killer had to have been very close. That the fatal blow had been given before the victim even realized. Yeah, he's he has a very blank face. What could Mr. Be John Vogue, Montreal. Carl was taken aback. He knew this address. It was said to be the address of the P.O. box for the Canadian Secret Service. Oh, snap. They were going over my head. That's not their jurisdiction. Ah! Um... Can I get a smoke? No. Can of beans? Nothing. Um... Uh, uh, why am I walking so slow, my lord? Oh, an explosion suddenly occurred outside. Let's go outside. 
Ooh, what's this? Generator? Electricity turned off. Why? Electricity from generator? Okay, that's on. On. The note explained that the garage and the store couldn't be supplied with electricity at the same time. Oh. Okay. So we got it. Let's let's. Um. Well, surely one of them can, right? Guess not. A secretary wouldn't be luxury in here. Cash register instructions. To open the cash register, punch the price two numbers minimum. Press sale. Turn the crank two times. Punch the machine if it doesn't work. Punch the machine. Okay. That's that's good stuff. Carl, whip, whip out the flashlight. Read flyer. Oh, is it the same one? I think it is. Uh, nope. Northern Quebec's economy is booming. The north of Chibigama area's population will soon reach 30,000 souls, among which thousands of happy families will be prospering thanks to the hard labor of their fathers who will be contributing valiantly in expanding Quebec's national wealth. Mines and hydroelectricity, hunting and fishing. The true Canadian dream. Turn it into your reality now. Why do they talk about like moving to Quebec like this? Jesus. The mines, a sector in full expansion. Did you know that since 1960, Canada tripled the amount of resource royalties it collects? Did you know that the country's true res true source of richness is lying under your feet at this very moment? The building of our schools and our hospitals depends on minerals. Exploiting our resources, the road to our future. Wow, that's sad. All right, Carl. The general store also serves as a post office for locals. Okay. That's neat. Can get it all in one place. What's that? Amateur hunters showing some pride in having killed a nice pelted beast. With men like this roaming the area, wolves would become extinct within ten years, Carl thought. Fixed generator. Carl was no electrician, hmm. but he could identify a wiring problem in the somewhere. There's probably tools in here, I'd assume. Maybe. It's a general store. Oh, let's play some music. Are there tools in here? Pump one, pump two. Oh, what's this? Letter from Gilly Carl Gillis. That Gilles Lachance was in charge of the general store. Gill. That made him one of Hamilton's employees. A very angry employee, as Carl could plainly see. You know what, Hamilton? I have a frog in my throat. Probably from all the hordes of frogs. And when people have a frog in their throat, they do not take risks by going to work. What is that? Why? Customers could catch it, right? I'm a wise man. Not to worry. I will have a nice doctor's note, which I'm going out to get right now. Sadly, in the meantime, I will have to close down the shop, unless you would like to come in for me. <laughs> I wouldn't dare advise you, after all. You must know how it's done, since it's yours now. With kind regards, your dedicated manager, Gil. Damn, Gil. Tell him, buddy. Um, um, uh, mm, do, 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 sale. Oh, it worked. And, oh, no, give me the key, buddy. Sale. Oh, fuck. Sale. I got a key. For what, though? Don't I haven't seen anything I needed a key. I'm already inside the building. Are there tools? Maybe it's in the garage. Maybe the tools and duct tape and everything are in the garage. Is this the garage key? Mm, we will see. Let's go. Unlock it. Uh, do do do. Uh, nope. Okay, it's not in this one. Post key. Okay, so what's the post? Where's the post anyway? Uh, oh. Oh, what is the that? Murder weapon. 
What was Zack doing there, Carl wondered. Hamilton must have been determined to keep some information secret to post this key. Ooh. Shame he got unlucky. What do we got? Everything made sense now. Poor Hamilton's denunciation was interrupted. And Oof. he figured it would be best to lock everything up and send the key to his correspondent, who would receive the box later on. <laughs> Clever. Clever. But not enough. It is That's as a citizen of ordinary people <laughs> playing spy. It is as a citizen of Her Majesty and the free economic chambers of the world that I must address what follows to the proper authorities. The worst is happening at this very moment. I cannot write at length, but I am requesting immediate help from my country. I believe the free world is in grave danger. A member of my community, the Honorable. It goes. It's it's gone. There's nothing left. Can I equip the gun? Why? I don't see why I would need it, actually. Um, equipment. Equip. Aim. Oh, it's a wobbly boy. Alright. Uh, we gotta find... The place is a mess. Yeah, I can see that. A radiator without power is as good as a wood stove without logs. It's pretty good. Not in the mood to drink maple syrup. Why would you ever be in the mood to drink maple syrup, dude? That's disgusting. <laughs> All right, let's let's figure this out. Okay. There's gotta be tools somewhere. Where are they? Think, think. Da, da, da. What is that? Fire starter, fire starter. Okay. Still not what we need. Uh, what is this? Nothing. Just. Okay. Where would tools be? I think. Uh, customer credit. According to that log. It seemed like the whole village owed some money to the general store. Rough. Carl was far more interested in the bunch of nearby addresses he had just gotten his hands on. Ah. Four matches. So we have the duct tape. Uh, garage key. Boom. There we go. Making progress. Let's move. Garage key. Here we come. Whip it out, Carl. Carl, ever diligent in his work, always carried his log on him. Okay. In which he scribbled down thoughts and leads alike during the course of his investigations. All right, we're looking for some pliers, I guess. Hmm, the cleanest spot in the area. Ha! Get it? Because it's all cleaning supplies. Hardware. Nothing. We got the pliers. Is there anything else in here of use? Might as well keep checking. Can I play some tunes? I can. Um, these are some banging tunes, dude. Quebec, I dig it. We got some good artists, good local local talent. You need to start exporting that instead of exploiting your land, silly kids. All right. Let's go fix the generator. That way we can power the store and therefore the pumps. Hopefully that's how this works. Boom. Dang, Carl, you're an engineer too? What can't you do? Um, is the store on? I guess so. And turned off. So it's electricity from power line, electricity from generator. Now let's test it. Is it actually on? Well, what the what the diddly dang? The note explained mm -hmm. that the garage and the store couldn't be supplied with electricity at the same time. Okay. Well, the garage is flipped off. How? Okay. We don't want to turn that on. Wait. Is like the generator not on? What's like what's up with 
Do we have to turn the generator on? Is that the deal? Oh, okay. Okay. Silly. Let's test it. Turned off. Alright, generator. Now, let's flick the lights. Ah! I think they're on. They are on. Now, let's start up pump two. Bam! Alright, let's... What is this? No thanks, I prefer beer cold. Is it not cold in here? Alright, let's move. Carl's a man. He doesn't drink cold beer. That's... I mean, warm beer. That's silly. Alright, let's fill up. Nice. He left his truck running. You're not supposed to do that when gassing up. Fill up gas can. Can I do that? Do I have to have a gas can? Carl knew straight away where to find the infuriated De La Chance. De La Chance. Investigation would have to start there. Well, we'll find Gil Lachan on the next episode. Thanks for joining me. If you enjoyed it, maybe like, maybe support me. Thanks. Have a good one, guys.